What is up, guys? Jake Pitts here. Um, I'm in Vegas right now in my room. I'm thinking about... Uh, I, I decided to do a quick video. Basically, um, it, uh, I, I am vlogging uh, Vegas. I'm going to walk down to the Bellagio. It's uh, like 1.6 miles away. <sighs> going to get my cardio in today at some point. It's nine, almost 9.30, so i got to get down there soon. Uh, Google Maps says it's about a half an hour walk. We'll see. There's a lot of stuff to see on the way. I've never really gotten to hang out in Vegas too much, so um, probably going to be looking at a lot of stuff too, but I want to get down and see the Bellagio Water Fountain uh, show because uh, I've just I've never seen it before. So um, I've been kind of vlogging today a little bit and uh, walking around a little bit. I got something wrong with my eye. Can you guys see that? My It's my left eye. Look at this. I guess I popped a blood... A blood vessel in my eye. I don't know how I did that. I don't know if it's from headbanging. I think it happened in Denver. Because um, I noticed... Uh, I was asked, like, oh, what's wrong with your eye? And I didn't feel anything, but I was just like, what are you talking about? I was like, oh, great. I always have eye problems. I have I had, I've had some stuff wrong with my eye. Luckily, I still have really great vision. I've had a lot of eye problems, but my vision, I don't wear glasses. I don't wear contacts. And my vision is awesome. And this isn't affecting my vision. Like, everything's still clear. Um, so I'm blessed with having good vision thus far in my life. Um, hopefully, it stays that way. But... Um, ah, it's pretty gnarly looking. I don't know what happened. I don't know if it's from headbanging or what, but what what we think might have happened was uh, the other day when we were doing the meet and greet, and it was in Denver. Um, we did the meet and greet, and we were doing the pictures, and there were, we were taking one picture, and I had to sneeze so like right as. Uh, our guy was taking the picture. I had to sneeze really bad. And I was holding it. I was just like... Like really holding it. And it's like waiting for the picture to be taken. Because I don't want to be like sneezing right in the middle of the the picture. So I held it. And my face felt like, felt like it was going to explode. Uh, so as soon as the picture was finally done. You know I sneezed really hard. And uh, I don't know if that's what did it. I don't know if it was the elevation change. Everyone's always like, oh, the oxygen in Denver, it's different. Like, oh, I get winded easier, easier, easier. Um, and I've never noticed anything up there. And, of course, the one time I actually say, oh, I don't notice a difference uh, being in Denver. And I don't notice the elevation change. I, this happens and my eye explodes. <laughs> what are the chances? Of course. I'm, oh, I've never noticed a difference here. And then my eye blows up. Um, I hope it doesn't get any worse. I can feel it. It doesn't hurt. It's almost itchy. It's irritating. It is kind of bugging me a little bit, but I guess this vlog, it was, I had a purpose for this vlog and I'm going to get to that point, but it became all about my eye explosion. Eye explosion. There's a band name for you. Anyway, this is just kind of a one deal. I'm just going for it. Just talking to you guys. Um, what I wanted to, my point was, I don't know where I was going, I'm just blabbing. Um, our album is out. Blackville Bride, self-titled record, BVB4. It's done. I can't believe it. We went through, you know, it was, it was the, I had the most fun ever making that record, uh, than we have had making any of the records. It was just such a great experience. Uh, working with Bob Rock was incredible, and, uh, it, it was just everything was uh, a positive note on my end. Um, no, no negative anything to say about the making of this record. It was a really fun experience, and um, I think it shows. We all had an awesome time. But my point being with this vlog is the record is out, so go buy it, go get it. And if you go to Best Buy and buy the record, you get a bonus track called Sons of Night. So, if you've already bought the record, 
That's awesome, and thank you so much for supporting the band. But go buy it from Best Buy, too, because you get the bonus track. And I promise you, you won't be disappointed with it. Uh, it's got some of my craziest guitar work on the bonus track, so that's why you should go buy it. Um, lead guitar, solos. I've got solos right out of the gate of the song. Uh, probably one of my... Sorry, I'm not picking my nose. My nose is just itchy. Um, probably one of my craziest solos, maybe. On the, whole, on the whole thing that we did. It's definitely one of my favorites. I'm kind of bummed, honestly, to say that, uh, that it didn't make the actual record. I mean, it's on the record. It's just on, it's a bonus track. Not that it didn't make it. It's on a special version. But uh, I really like the, the track. I think it's a really good one. Uh, some crazy, crazy guitar parts on that. So definitely check it out. It's a great song all around. Um, and if you haven't gotten the album yet, please go out and pick it up. Especially this week. So guys, go out, pick the album up, check it out, listen to it. For those of you who already have the record, tell me what your favorite song is. Leave it in the comments below, right down here. I want to know what your favorite song is. And don't just say, like, one, don't, don't say, like, two or three songs. Tell me what your absolute favorite track is on the record. And now I know for uh, a lot of people that might be difficult, because for me, it's kind of tough. My favorite track on the record. It's kind of a tough one because honestly, it. I started listening to the record again last night, and I was like, "Man, this it's so good. I'm I'm so proud of this record." Um, Faithless is definitely one of my favorite tracks uh, as far as a heavy song. Um, it's just an ass kicker. I love it. I think it's one of our heaviest songs we've ever done, and it's so much fun to play. It's difficult. It's challenging. Uh, the solo's definitely challenging, and some wicked parts in there. Um, uh, I like to challenge myself, so I think that's a reason why that's one of my favorite songs. But I would have to say Walk Away is probably right up there with it as well, just because it's, you know, the big power ballad. But just the uh, the way Bob helped us kind of mold that song from what the demo was and, and really kind of make the ballad heavier than what it was, you know, with the guitarists and the chorus and squealies and, and whatnot, like... Um, I don't know, and, and I think my solo work in that one, that, that's definitely one of my favorite solos I've, if not my favorite solo uh, that I've ever done, ever, that I've ever written. I don't know. I, I had the idea, basically those those first two notes, the I had that idea in my head, and I wanted to, I knew that it had that little lick had to be somewhere in that solo, and I didn't, know how to start the solo off so I just decided you know what I'm just gonna why not just start the solo that way that's how I wrote that solo I had that idea in my head just that little first lick and then I just went from there with it and it uh, came out really awesome I'm very proud of it and I think it's awesome and I'm just blabbing right now but uh, anyways here's one thing I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you guys now this is a weird question because normally you know we probably wouldn't ask this kind of question but what is your least favorite song on the record? Now, I'm hoping nobody has a least favorite song, and that's like... Now, that's a hard question to ask, because a favorite track, that's easy, but a least favorite? I want to know what you guys think. And leave it in the comments below. Let me know what your least favorite track is. Let me know what your favorite track is, too. But if you have a least favorite track, hopefully not too many people are like, oh, my least favorite track is this, because blah, 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 because you suck at guitar. Hopefully... We're not getting too many of those, but uh, if you have a least favorite track, I want to know. I want to hear your thoughts. I want to know what you guys think about this new record. Leave it in the comments. I'll reply. I do check the the uh, comments as much as I can. Um, being out here on the road, I don't have Wi-Fi all the time. Sometimes sketchy, um, but I do read the comments on my phone and everything too. So. Anyway, I'm going to stop blabbing now and get get off my get off this thing. I'm going to go walk down to the Bellagio and I'm going to show you guys that stuff later in another vlog. So, let me know, like the video, subscribe to my channel. Be sure to check out my other vlogs, check out my guitar lessons. Also, uh, I'm editing and uploading my Get Mean Fitness channel stuff. So, 
I've got it on my page. Go over there, subscribe to that channel so you can be notified when that stuff is up. It'll be up shortly. I promise it's coming. Sorry it's taking so long. Anyway, guys, I appreciate all the support and for you guys following me and watching my nonsense. I appreciate it so much. And I will see you either in the next vlog, at the next show, or who knows, maybe on the street. Might run into you somewhere. All right, guys. Later.